This manager must have a lot of faith in him, and I'm not sure why. He's given up five hits in this inning alone, and it doesn't look like it's going to come to an end anytime soon. Now batting, Brandon Lowe. First pitch coming, here it is. Line towards center field. Bradley is there, and he puts it away to stop the bleeding. So it's four runs on five hits, no errors, and a man left. We're through five here at the ballpark. The Rays lead it 15 to nothing. Riding in for Boston, Christian Vasquez. He'll start things out in their half of the sixth as they look to shake things up here for a lineup that, quite frankly, has been non existent to date. No doubt about that, Matt. They've been completely overmatched at this point. One hit through five innings. I mean, what else can you say about the pitching they faced other than it's been fantastic? We'll see if that continues as we approach the later inning. And it's fouled away. Batter's going to have to find a way to regroup right there. That caught too much of the plate. He knew it. He missed it. He might not get another opportunity to put the ball in play. Another one sent foul. Now another 0 2. Count remains at 0 and 2. Another 0 and 2 coming. Oh, and he can only battle for so long as he's finally set down here after an eight pitch at bat. I'll tell you he looks really dialed now in on the bump right there. He's got the a shutout three. going and he really oh, seems to have this lineup off balance. Even when he challenges them up in the zone they don't have an answer for it. To his left oh. Wendell and the off balance throw beats him at first and that's a tough play. There's the second baseman now second Dustin base. Pedroia over oh, two on the afternoon so far. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. And there's ball one. This offense is going to have to find a way to get going. It's happened in the past. Every team goes through it where everyone seems to fall into a funk at the same time. Everyone needs to relax and not try and be the hero and just start getting the leadoff guy on. Fouled off. No runs, just one hit, and no errors for the Red Sox to this point. And he will strike him out. Ten now in the ball game, and the inning is over. Red Sox go down one, two, three. Start the bus. They're down 15 to nothing. Stepping into the box, G-Man Choi. He could really man. use a knock here, 0 for 3 Joy. in the game so far. Skied down the left field line. And no one will track it down. Hit hard on the ground to first. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. And a good effort as he's able to gather it in and make a play for the first out. Up next for Tampa Bay. And that'll bring the up Joey Wendell. Joey. He's ready. Here's the first Wendell. offering. Lifted the other way out to left center. Chasing after it is Bradley. And he tracks it down. A nice running play to record the second out. Number five. Digging in. Matt Duffy. He singled his last time up. Hit on the ground to short. Bogarts has it. 
And the throw just does beat him at the bag, so the side is retired. Ray's good. One, two, three. Now the Red Sox DH, J.D. Martinez. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. Kiermaier is right there, one down. Now batting. Here's Mookie right Betts. Here. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Yeah. And this pitch is taken oh, on the inner oh. half for strike one. We're moving along late into this one, and it's no surprise this guy continues to pitch well. Over 80% of his first pitches have been for strikes. And when you're doing that, you really put the hitters on the defensive. Fouled away. Ready with another 0-2. And he struck him out. And there's strikeout number 11 in the ball game. Pretty clear he didn't like the call there on the outside part of the plate, but probably too good to take. And he's down on strikes for the second time. Yeah, that pitch was right on the black. Beautiful pitch. And even if we had robot umps, he'd still be out. But the only difference would be he wouldn't be able to complain about it. Now a swing and a fly ball. Long run, but he gets there to track this Ladies one down and a very nicely off. recorded out number three. Seven. Down in order go the Red Sox. Ryan Brazier comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. And leading off. Hit hard down the line. And a reach to his backhand, but he can't come up with it, and the leadoff man's aboard. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. The fans didn't even get a chance to settle in their seats for the beginning of the inning. And he just Watch. blistered that ball down the line from the first pitch he saw. It stayed fair, and he's safely on second with the leadoff double. That's the way you lead off an inning. Played on the backhand. And there's one down there. At the plate, Daniel Robertson. He hit a two-bagger and later scored in his previous plate appearance. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes line towards center field. Bradley is there now and he has it two gone. That's Stepping in and ready for another the shot. Guillermo ready in scoring position with two gone. Oh, this guy right here that last AB. How about straight away center field. He hits a bump. Into the slide and he comes up with a great catch to end the inning. Maybe a rug burner two after that one as we get another look at it here. Don't touch that remote. More on MLB Network right After this, the left handed hitting Andrew Benintendi stands in. We're in the eighth now, and nothing's changed out there on the mound. Well, I've been very impressed with how the starter's going about his business, Matt. He's looked really sharp, and it's hard to know if it's had any effect, but getting that early lead from his offense could have really helped settle him in. Into the windup, here comes the 0 2 pitch. Uh, and he's just rolling right now, and even dozen strikeouts for him in the ballgame. 
Ready now, now Steve Pierce. He went down on strikes last time up. Yeah, Maddie, big time K last time up, and it's been a tough series for him so far. You can tell he's just not seeing the ball off this team. Let's see if he can make an adjustment right here. Mm, chased out of the zone there, and he's down two strikes. Got him. As he just continues to mow down these hitters, 13 strikeouts now. Digging now in, Jackie Bradley Jr. First two men Jackie in the Jr. inning have both Bradley gone down Jr. via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. The 0-1 delivery. Right. right by him here, and he's set up for another strikeout here. The count to 0-2. And, and there's number eight, one away. And he's going to add to the total 14 punch outs now as that ends the inning. So add one more. Now in the box, Kevin Kiermeyer, three for four Leading so up, far, and seeing it well in this ball the game. Fielder, Kevin. Right side, hit hard. Yeah. And a reach to his backhand, but he can't come up with it, and the leadoff man's aboard. Man, talk about having a good game. Like most guys, this would be a good Number week. Eight. Fourth hit of the game. And two of those d rose round trippers. Yeah, he's going to have a smile on his face for a while here, Dan. These are special nights. You have to enjoy these. These don't come around often, and he is taking full advantage of it. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. A swing, and this one is blasted to right field. Nothing's going to stop it. And this ball is gone. No chance to make a play on that one. A two-run blast to straightaway right field. Second home run early in the year as this lead got even wider. The batter. The Into the box, G-Man Choi. G-Man Choi. As he rips it on the ground to second. Pedroia has it. On the first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. Now batter. So the Tampa's base batting base. order turns now over here. and set to go. Joey Wendell go. is looking for his third hit of the ball game here. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Waiting on it is Ben Intendi. Two down. Striding in and five. working on a terrific performance Matt. in this one, Matt Duffy. And we'll see if he can put together a rare five-hit performance here. Strike one to start the at-bat. The wind-up and the 0-1. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Around first, he's digging for second. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Boy, and they have not been able to get him out. This is now a five-hit ball game for him here. And those don't come along every day. Standing in now, Tommy Pham. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. And, oh, he missed a home run by a matter of feet. It's off the wall. Throw to second, but he's in there as a run will score on the play as well. Now batting. Man, it's Hester. like deja vu all Boy. over again. Two well hit back to back Here doubles that bring in a run. This one ends up going off the wall, and it looks like they've got a pretty good idea what this guy's trying. Is swung on and driven out to right center field. A ball that's well hit. So it's a two-run shot to right center, his second home run of the game, as the blowout continues. Erasmo Ramirez enters now in a mop-up roll as he'll try to keep...